Have you ever tried to navigate your way through a dense forest without a map or compass? It's a daunting task, but a vector pointing in the right direction can make the journey much smoother. However, sometimes we need to break down a vector into its components to understand how it behaves in different directions. That's where the concept of vector resolution comes in. Vector resolution is the process of breaking down a vector into its component parts. These components are typically defined along a set of orthogonal axes, which means that they are perpendicular to each other. To understand vector resolution, imagine you're standing and want to walk to a tree 100 meters away at a bearing of 30 degrees from north. To determine the distance you need to walk in the north and east directions, we can draw a set of orthogonal axis, with one axis pointing north and the other pointing east and use trigonometry. The north axis would be 100 times sine 30, which is 50 meters, and the component vector along the east axis would be 100 times cos of 30, which is 86.6 meters. This process allows us to understand how the vector behaves in each of these directions and can help us solve complex problems involving multiple vectors.